morning. Bright and early, first day back. Didn't get much sleep. Worrying about Kyle. We'll see him again soon. He's going to be OK. You know what those places are like, especially for kids that aren't equipped. He's your son. He's equipped. Welcome back. Free man, eh? Must feel good. What, with my kid inside? Yeah, but I'll get sorted, right? Right, well, that's put me at ease. Right. I'll, uh, go and get some brew stuff. Get the kettle high. Sir. Out, then. How are you doing? Well, my son's been locked away for killing someone, so... Well, it's a plea here in Thursday, innit? That'll make you feel better. Or worse. I tried to book a visit this morning, but the phone lines don't open till nine. Like it's some sort of flipping nine or five job. Maybe it is. Maybe they just lock the place in between and let them crack on, survival of the fittest. They don't. He's fine. Look, do you think Caleb's going to be able to get this thrown out? His people, I mean. They reckon it's only a matter of time. Since when did what he says mean anything? Well, you've changed your tune since yesterday. No, I haven't. So what did you say to him in the pub, then? Um, uh, I said to him that he's served his purpose and he needs to get gone. Just that? Well, that and I'll kill him if I see him. Oh, my God! Kane! Come on, I didn't mean it. We don't need him. Oh, yeah, cos you've got experience getting kids out of secure units. Right. I tell you what, I don't need this, that's for sure. This is Al all over again. No, it isn't. Death threats and trying to get rid of someone, are you sure? If it wasn't for Caleb, Kyle would still be in school right now. So before you go sticking your nose in, why don't you open your eyes and see him for what he really is? Nothing. All right, yeah, I'll do that, but can I just make one suggestion? Go on. If you want to meet Caleb in a barn with a gun, make sure Isaac hasn't followed you. 